The Worst Roblox Simulator Games Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video here on Top Blox's channel. In this video, we're going to talk about the worst simulator games on Roblox. There's apparently a simulator phase on Roblox from 2018 to 2019 with a ton of bad simulators. Let's take a look at some of the worst, stay tuned. Before we begin, make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Also turn on the bell for the latest notifications and updates. This way you'll never miss another video. With that said, let's begin and get straight into it. Baby Simulator the first game on the list is Baby Simulator by Broken One Studio. This game is exactly what the name suggests. The game is simply you, either as a boy or a girl baby. You level up as you crawl around and punch the air. Other babies in the game are bigger or smaller. There is no reward or incentive to keep the players playing the game. Alternatively, this game is very boring and just a waste of time. Pilot Training Flight Simulator The next game we have is Pilot Training Flight Simulator by Orange12345. The game is a little bearable than the Baby Simulator as it gives you the ability to fly a bunch of aircraft around the massive map with other players. However, there are several limitations to the game, one of which you can virtually cannot die, which means there are no stakes or risks to the game, and as you know, such games can never be interesting long term. Saber Simulator The game title might sound interesting and is also quite good, but it is still a letdown. The game merely involves you swiping the sword in the air just as you gain points from it. No one can hurt each other, so 9 times out of 10, players are just slinging their swords at each other on the vast map. And as for this reason, Saber Simulation makes this list. Pet Simulator Next we have Pet Simulator by Big Game Simulator. This game is very similar to Baby Simulator, it also has no incentive just like that game. Your game starts after you choose to raise a dog or cat as your pet. After assigning the name to your pet, you are just made to roam around the map and purchase stuff from the store with Robux, and if you do not have any Robux, the game ends for you. Furthermore, the pet walks extremely slow, which provides you with an infuriating experience and is very disappointing. Destruction Simulator The next game we choose is Destruction Simulator by Silky underscore Dev. This game is a little more digestible than others, but ultimately falls short as well. Upon starting the game, countless rooms and destroyable things are shown to be available, but only a few are actually available. This game had a lot of potential, but bad gameplay. Slow graphics and physics ultimately leads to a letdown in the case of this game. Superhero Fighting Simulator the next game we have is Superhero Fighting Simulator by Enrico Crime. This game is simply a tycoon game under the name of a simulator game making it fake and misinformed. Players are given superpowers and weapons upon joining the game and are tasked with fighting monsters. These monsters distract players from their tycoon objective resetting in a confusing and ultimately pointless game. Black Hole Simulator Next we have Black Hole Simulator. The game is essentially the same as a baby simulator, but with black holes and increasingly grows in size and more orbits you consume. This is a little more interesting and better than Baby Simulator, however, the promotionals littered throughout the map along with the so-called safe zones spoil the game and make it less desirable to play. Popsicle Simulator Up next we have Popsicle Simulator by Meteor Studios. This is another game that is out to waste the player's time. The only objective in this game is to lick popsicles and deliver them to certain houses and these delivery missions are not posed to be challenging whatsoever. Directions and holds are shown on screen while playing the game and this takes away from all the fun from the game. Shrink Ray Simulator We next choose a Shrink Ray Simulator, an exact copy of the Pet Simulator game. This game banks on you to spend your Robux on the game promotional and in-game purchases. If you don't have any, the game is a waste of time and plus the Shrink Ray doesn't even really work. Gas Station Simulator Finally, we have this game, Gas Station Simulator by Just For Fun. This is quite possibly the most boring and pointless simulator game to exist on Roblox. The controls are never almost certainly and properly explained, leaving the player in confusion. Furthermore, the cars driven by NPCs don't do anything to your character. This is the most broken and unrealistic game ever. Playing this game is just a waste of time. This brings us to the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed it. 